Did you hear about the Queen giving up polo? Can't believe it, can you? Only from us a packet, haven't they? <laughs> Celebrating each of the eight decades since the Midland was built. Vintage clothes worn and for sale. A packed market arranged by Morecambe's most fashionable son. Morecambe is starting to walk with a swagger again and this building has been played a major role in that and there's some good artworks and young people are starting to rediscover it. The traders were dealing in top-end vintage fashion, at least one after losing her job earlier this year. It's very good for someone like me who's struggled to get a job um, and there's definitely something now that I can focus on and do. What goes around comes around. Decor not seen since the 1960s proving popular with 21st century boys and girls. I can do without my coffee, I can do without my tea, I can do without my sugar, those things don't bother me. To be here in one of the most beautiful buildings, to be celebrating their 80th anniversary and to be part of it, it's just magical, it's beautiful. Cars too, many from the 70s, 60s and before. It just looked like a yet, but... Really? 